fish and smelt and shiners today. Little tiny hooks. Going for going for brook a trout. I was a little surprised how much depth I had right next to this dock. But I got about probably eight, ten foot right here. I'm gonna send it probably oh three foot down off the surface. I have a tall Robert for a trap. What do you guys call these very tall Roberts? Large Roberts. Large Roberts. Yeah, I don't think I gained anything. <laughs> about eight inches of water here but I'm gonna set it what's it look like I'm still gonna set it it looks like absolutely gorgeous gravel I'll probably jig some today, but first I want to get some traps in. Oh, what a <laughs> shot! That's oh, we got all the bass fishing gears. Yeah, flipping. Just getting it right under the dock. So that's seven, probably. All <laughs> <laughs> oh, them years of bass flipping. Well, I got at least two flags up, fellas. Should we get them or leave them? I they had a coffee pot, but the gas station had no, like, folders or anything. Just the instant folders. What's going on out here? What do you think, fellas? you want to catch some fish today? I'd like to. Big old rock ate it. Chubbs, give him some moral support. This is your chance to get in on the video. Kill it, Sean. You can do it. <laughs> that's taking some line. A lot of line. It's decent. There's a ways out. Shaking? Get on that crap. No, it's not shaking. He's far. Any cheesy bits of line. Any head? He kind of keeps coming and going. I'm feeling better. To... Any head shakes? Nothing shaking. Dude, that thing's kind of coming in. Reel it. Ooh. 
What was that? A little tug. A little tug. It's definitely the heaviest thing I felt of the trip. <laughs> Which is pretty easy to do. <laughs> You good there? You don't need me to smooth. Nope, you're right. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Did you hung up? Oh, oh, he's right here. He's big, whatever he is. That wasn't a cask, was it? I not see it. Holy shit. I saw a big white belly. Big old sand. Quite a hole. Is he pulling good? Hanging out. He wants to go. Cusk. No shit. What are you doing catching a cusk <laughs> in the foot of water in the middle of the day? <laughs> That's cusk nuggets, though. Cusk nuggets. Beautiful. Nice. Joke happy. Yeah, best, fi <laughs> best eating fish in this lake. <laughs> Woo! There we go. Yeah, baby. Cusk nuggets. They look like it was bubbling. Yeah, I shifted. The Jobs! Wind. The wind's this way now, isn't it? I think it's gonna be. Can't even see. Alright, Wayne, we gotta see a good fish today. I don't see anything in there. We're rolling? Trip pretty good. Take any line? Oh, there you go. Where? It didn't it roll? Oh, I got. Well, just, he you took got some one. line. Did he? Yeah, because look, there's no sinker. Oh, yeah. The sinker's not on here, is it? Oh, we took some line. Wait. Yep. Oh, there yep. you go. Oh, I feel him. Feel him? Yep. Got him? Oh, no! Oh, did he oh, come off? He's back. Okay. Good one? Nah, nothing great. I got my leader right here. Puppy's a perch. How long is your leader? Oh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah! I've never had that done to me. <laughs> Whoa! Good one, Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Thank good you. job. Oh, oh you got the God. big one of the day. Oh, I saw no foot tracks, nothing. Yeah, I did about a half hour ago. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Jobs, here you go. Oh. That was your idea, not mine. There you go. I said, oh, he took some line, too. <laughs> I've never so. fallen for that. I've seen it done. Yeah. Probably a perch. If I had a skimmer, I, if I had a skimmer, I would have done that one. Oh, no, it's bad. Oh, that's fun there. That's a good way to break up the monotony. <laughs> All right, guys, it is pretty serious out here. It's blowing straight sideways on us. Snowing like a sieve. This is all from today. It was glare ice yesterday, so it's built up pretty good. As you can see, I just did a... I just did a trap check. There was nothing up for flags, so we're kind of chilling in the... inside the nice warm shack. Let's check it out. He's never here. What's up? Just yeah. showing the folks at home how nice and Dude. warm the shack is. Yeah. Is it snowing out there still? Yeah. Wayne's got the biggest fish of the day. Yeah. 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 Just, it was 12 ounces. Yeah, we had one on the screen when it's going Oh, down. really? I couldn't get there fast enough. No. He had a. He just caught a blue back. Yeah. 
Because I think it's wrapped up or it's really big. It feels like a cask wrapped up on something. Jesus. I think it's just a big beer can. <laughs> Watch out behind you, Wayne. I got a camera rolling. Oops, you're all right. We're oh. rolling up the stick for sure. Huh? I got sticks on it for sure. Want me to get any of that out or Sure, not? yeah, go ahead. It's got a lot of sticks on it, I know that. You got fish too, you think? It felt like a fish too, yeah. Not a line I don't know if there's still a fish, but there's a stick for sure. I mean, I'm pulling like 50 yards, 50 pounds of. Fish. Not a bad fish, huh? Mess around, I catch them. Chubbs just had a flag. Nothing going. No. Nope. They're turning on now, fellas. They took line. Took a ton of line. Did it just go up? I have no idea. I Who's, gotta, you saw it up? The guy came to no, put, I checked Chubbs and then I came over here and it was up. I came to put that in. The brookies are really getting. Nothing. Steal your bait again? Dang. Oh. Afternoon breakfast. What you got going on out here? Leftover breakfast. Just, uh, little heat up. <laughs> Did you heat it up? Melt the table off. Have that piece of bacon. There you go, Joe. Did you get one of these earlier? That's so good. Thank you. That bacon's wicked good. Mmm. Thick cut. That's okay. Got him? 
What's he feeling like? I don't know. He feels small. Oh, okay. Brookie? Yeah. He's feeling a little bigger now. Nice. He's on the Brookie control here. Yeah. Coming toward me. Taking a lot of light, Andrew. Like what is going on there? It's the the, the bike turned on finally. I fixed that trap up there for you, too. Oh, you did? Is it set? Uh, no, okay. uh, I don't know what happened. The leader has snapped off. Oh, really? What do you got here, Andrew? I don't know. It's spinning around the hole. I think it's a salmon. That's not a, a laker, is it? Laker, yeah. yeah. It's a little laker. Ah, I thought it was a salmon. Oh, it's a racer. You want a cup of Raymond? <laughs> oh. Yeah, my have Bad some. boy. <laughs> We're pushing it hard. Oh, jeez. Oh, we might make it. It's going to be close. You guys are all in luck today. This is this is my specialty. I put a lot of hours right? of training into this top Raymond. Bob. Here you go, Bob. There you go. That's the best I can do. Thank you, Brady. Your top Raymond's ready. There's a seat over here too, Charlie. Go sit down. Yeah. Chicken or beef? Oh, I don't care. Pick one. Not beef. I wanted that one. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I throw, when we're on a trip like this, the trash and bottles go in the same bag, and I just throw it all away. Well, if I had your money, I'd do that too. <laughs> if I had your money, I'd burn mine. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Little guy. A big sucker. You're on the board. All right. We got to get a brookie top side today. I like this set a lot. Big fish. Any fish. It's running. Hung up. Feels all right, but it's in the rocks.
feel with this, but. Alright, now we gotta go to work. Time to drill, baby. I'll double check my angle. Oh, did it move? I think I might have gained. I think I'm gaining. It feels like it's still there. Feels like I'm bringing up a stick or a rock. Hopefully it's still on. I think I have it to the hole. I think it's a stick wedge. Yep. It's a stick wedge. Now I gotta see if there's a fish on it. I'm pretty sure the fish is still on it. He's wrapped around this stick so many times. I'm gonna try to hook the line that's off the stick. First, I might try to get the stick. And I'm gonna try to hook the line where it comes off the... There's so much line coming off. Crazy mess. Well, this just one fish tossing this whole time. I don't know if the fish is on it or not, but I think it is. You got a fish stick. A, pit, a stickle. Hmm. Alright, I see the line, I got a hook. It's looped so many times in this stick. I don't know which end goes to the fish. Should that screen be on? No. Nope. Oh, I see my leader at least. So if the fish is on. Yep. Oh 
Oh god, there's a fish on it. Can you see the fish? No, but it's decent. Make the thing to do. I hate to even do this. Give her a good tug? Nope. Go. I'm gonna try to go down. RV. Get that stick. If I can get the stick. <coughs> home. There we go. The stick's broken. Well, maybe not. Be a fish. Be still on. Yep. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Whoa. Look at that thing. Yeah, baby! <laughs> that was yes. worth it. Yes! Look at that, Brookie! That's how you do it, guys. Don't give up on them, no matter what. That was awesome. What a staving brookie. That's a nice brookie. Look at how pretty that fish is. That's how you do it right there. When you think all's lost, it's not. See something? The hook's right there. Look at that. Got it. That was it. Look at that staving moosehead brookie. What a beauty. I think I gotta let it go. I think it's in that 18 to... Yeah. He's over 18. Yeah, I'd say he's 20. Brother, put your I'm gonna let him go. All right, let's get a good look at this release. This is a beautiful fish, guys. Look at how pretty that is. Ready? Oh, yeah. Get down there. Wrong way, sucker. Woo! That was awesome. Dude, what do you think of that? Good. Look at this mess, Sean. It's got my sounder in it. <laughs> uh, Holy cow, that's a different kind of cold right there. You're going to be cut in line. Oh. That was awesome, guys. I got a hole right there that's like six inches deep. And I got a hole out there that's like eight foot deep. But this was like two and a half, three foot deep, beautiful gravel. This joker wrapped me up. And I had to get down, as you saw to break it off. You never ever give up on a fish. You owe it to the fish if you're hung up to do your best to get them off. We drilled a hole over there. I tried to hook it, couldn't get it. Came back, reorganized, and look at this mess. Nothing went around that stick so many times. And if I don't catch him and I break off, he's still stuck to the stick and dies. So that's why you owe it to him, do your best. But what an awesome rookie, Moosehead Lake. We worked hard for that. It's been a long day. I had to go up to my teeth. Right what, to my oh, teeth. Your arm went in? All the way to the teeth. Whoa. I was Took stuck a on a sweatshirt off and everything. Everything, right down to, right down to the James Cook oh, nice. shirt. Yeah, take it that. Was I awesome. gotta go. You're gonna like that video. Yeah. Woo! Finally. I am fired up, baby. <laughs> What cool. an awesome brook. What a beautiful, healthy fish. That was a pretty fish. I'd yeah. say that was a 21. 21, yeah. It was 20, 20, 21. Yeah, it was well yeah. over 20. It was yeah. in the 20 range, yeah. but we weren't interested in killing it, obviously. And guys, if you get hung up like that, do your best to figure it out and try to get them unhung. Because, like I said, you might break off and say, well, that was too bad. I broke off, but that fish is still hung up to that, that log and he's going to die stuck to that. Work your best to get them off if you're if you guys are trying this at home. Benjamin, Sup? what's up? Sup? You having a great day? Yeah. You having a great trip? Yeah. Dude, you're on a serious trip here. If you're on a trip, grown men would give their arm left arm to be on. I'm about to fire some pizza up on this oven. What do you, you like? want? Pizza? Mm -hmm. All right, guys. We are in the what is this? Core shack. This is the core ice shack. Core ice shack. And Andrew was firing up a pizza a in the oven. Pepperoni pizza. Pepperoni. 
pepperoni <laughs> pizza in the oven. Let's make these pepperonis a little better. Yeah. It's a little, uh, a little bad looking. Go. Yeah. There we go. So first it was um, popcorn and now it's pizza. Yeah, and we're actually going to throw some cookies in there too. <laughs> I hope so. What do you think? Is that rack up too high? Ooh. Is the heat coming from the bottom? Yeah. It's Put it on that one. How's she going? He's just getting her figured out. We're going to do some cookies and some pizza at the same time. Um, yeah, I'm going to need that knife. Yeah, here you go. That's okay. I got a couple on me. A couple? On yeah. Me, uh, you should always have a couple on you. Exactly. Thank you. Yeah. This is actually I the first time we've used the oven. Blade, so. What's that, buddy? I carry a Swiss blade in the normal. You should have a Swiss Army knife. Yes. I have one. I have. I think I have three. Nice. If anyone ever gives you a gift knife, you need to give them a coin of any denomination back. And the coin prevents the sharp blade from cutting the friendship. Okay. Yep. Never knew that. Yep. If anybody gives you an axe or a knife or a sword Thank or anything you. sharp, you got to give them a coin. I never knew that. It can be any coin. Bad. Yeah, we might have just lit on fire. Yeah. Oh, that's true. I didn't think. I didn't think what's in those cherries. Wow. Let's get them cherries off the oven. That's yeah, a good idea. I don't believe those are regular cherries. Either the pizza is going to taste like cookies, or the cookies are going to taste like pizza. But I don't know if that'd right. be a bad thing on either one. When you're ice fishing, it doesn't matter. <laughs> all right, now give us the tour of this whole shack. All right, everybody. So this is a core ice shack. Um, we kind of bought it just to, you know, hang out, have fun. Everybody thinks we sell bait out of it, but we don't. So it's kind of crazy. We have the cooktop here. Um, we have the oven, obviously, that we just threw the cookies and the pizza in. We got a microwave up top. Cook some popcorn. Um, right behind you here, we have a TV. We have the radio, um, Bluetooth, AM, FM. Stereo system. Exactly, just more storage. Lights. Um, the cool thing is too, is that it actually has two bunks. Two so bunks, we'll see. Over on the other end yeah, over Yeah, go here. head over, bud. Um, you can kind of picture it a little bit, but this table slides down, the two cushions from here come in the middle, and then this bunk, well, it's kind of in storage right now, but we'll come down here, and then there you go, you can jake from bed. Um, Bring your electronics in. Uh, you can hook them up to the TV, but we haven't figured that out yet. You'll so. get there. Coat hanger, oh, yeah. storage, Rock I love holders. these seats. There's cup holders. I mean, it has everything you could ever ask for. And that rail system holds everything, right? Yes, up to 20 pounds, I think. Rod holders. You can have a little TV and TV. Tables. A table for your electronics and whatnot. Captain chairs. And actually, the cool thing is, is you have a, uh, a drill holder idea. Oh, that's really cool. And your little frozen. Yeah, it is in one of those. Huh? <laughs> that looks frozen. Oh, Get yeah, off. that's not good. <laughs> and then what's behind me? So behind you is what we call the fart closet. Um, that was actually named by the, uh, the manufacturers, and it's Inner. just a little closet for more storage, and we can put a little uh, a dimmer. I like that. That's the mood setter. Right oh, there. that's oh. awesome. <laughs> dimmer. Exterior lights, more storage, more storage, more storage, more storage, <laughs> plugs, USB ports, a new hole heater, speaker. So you could actually use this as a bathroom too. And, and it has these fans that are powered by the battery. You can pull in and out. Sean's looking to Try to get my drill off. My oh, this is the baby out. <laughs> and then you have your control panel right here, so you have all your lights, um, your exterior, right and left, um, work lights out for the front for when you're hooking up the trailer, um, your dime lights, and then your bathroom lights, flash for when uh, nice truckers let you in on the highway, so you can give them a little thank you. And it's all Bluetooth, so you can hook it up on the outside or from your phone and oh, really? control all the lights from your phone for the outside right here. That's pretty awesome. And you can kind of see. Oh yeah. It's all lit up all the way around. And it's a skid shack too, so. So what's it got, skis and tires? Skis and tires. And what lifts them up or down? So in the back here, we have more jacks. Mm -hmm. um, these you just put your drill on. Nice. And then in the front, there's just a hydraulic jack here, but pretty cool. It's uh, definitely fun to fish out of. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. It's luxury fishing. It's like glishing. Glamorous fishing. <laughs> Glishing. I like it. I've never heard that term before. And you can pull it in both variations too. Yeah. And the brand? Uh, it's Core Ice. Core Ice. Pretty Minnesota. awesome. Minnesota? Yep. Nice. 
Pretty awesome shack. And how big is it? Um, I believe this is a 14 or 15 foot trailer. What? Hot pizza? Ice fishing? Come on, Wayne. Hot pizza and cookies. You're spoiling me. <laughs> Get a hot cookie for the way home. Yep. Everybody throw a couple hot cookies in your belly for that ride home. Yeah. Drive a couple of them right into you. Let's You'll see. know what's good. It's gonna be a little nasty out there today. It's good. Yeah, it's real good. Thanks, bud. It's the pizza pie, yeah. Drive a couple of them in you before the ride. Watch your stuff coming out, guys. That's pretty deep. Pretty damn good. You're getting jacked up here. Jacked up. They got. They're hot. Are they hot? How'd they come out? Unreal. Real good. Real good. There we go. It's easy as that. Bring the other side up. Then we'll go inside, or actually, we can do something cool. We can get on our phone. If you look here, let's look at the whole panel. Wow. So, lift it right up. Right from the shack. Oh, it's hydraulic? Hydraulic in the front, not in the back. Oh, he's doing it on his phone right now. Can you go. do the lights from your phone? Do something fun. Do something cool with the lights. Competing with me. You want? Like, why are the lights going out? And I stepped on. I like the lights on. I turned them back on. See, you can change everything. There you go. The That's unreal. Right from the phone. Right now. What a trip, Joe Wallace. High five. Slap hands. Slap hands. Got the cookies ready. We've had our fill. We got a hot cookie or two in our belly, so I'm gonna run these over to the guys that are camping in by shore. This is their second or third day camping. I'll be right back, guys. I'm gonna run these over to those guys. Those guys camping over there. So nothing better than getting some hot cookies. I doubt they have any hot cookies over there, fresh out of the oven. What's up, guys? I brought you guys some delicious chocolate chip cookies hot oh, out of the oven. Out of the oven? <laughs> just out of the oven. How do you get really? that? Yeah, we just baked them up. They're right here. There's oh, a pile man. for you. I figured you guys wouldn't mind them on a, on a oh, cold, like, third night of camping. Yeah, we're just having a snack here. But... Guys eating dinner? No, oh, just snacking. Andrew, you make that machine look big. <laughs> Yeah. Well, guys, that is gonna do it for today on the hard water. Awesome, awesome day. Really tough fishing. Fish were just not cooperating. We hit a magical hour after 4 p.m. and got a togue, a brookie, had like four or five flags, had some hang ups. Chubbs nailed the togue. At the end of the day, he got, the, <laughs> he got my favorite one of the, is the, when you're going to pick up your last trap, and you're watching it and it goes up in front of you. Yeah. So it's cool. nothing better than picking up a trap with a fish on it. It's like the greatest thing ever. It's a yep. dream come true. Yep, pretty fun. It happened to me last year on my last flag of the year, picking up my last trap. I got that Staven Brookie at Ambajegis and he got to do it today. So pretty awesome. We're going to probably lose tubs for tomorrow. Got to go home. Got to go home. But. I wish I could stay. Yeah, we do too. But we got to. We got a bunch of stavers, bunch of staven fishermen going after some fish tomorrow. We're going off campus tomorrow to a small pond that's got some pretty good regulations on it. A lot of fish, nothing giant, but we should be able to get in some fish. We're looking at 45 to 50 mile an hour winds tomorrow, so it could be a rough day. Stay tuned. Hopefully we have some more fun for you. You know what I'm jealous of? Helmets. Helmets. Yeah. The only guy with no helmet. <laughs>
pretty jealous of that right now. I was oh, thinking yeah. about wearing sunglasses. I don't think your head would fit in my helmet, would it? No, I'm good. You sure? Because I got a windshield. No, I'll be all right. Just we got some pretty rough conditions. We got pretty good whiteout out there, so we're gonna be going home by feel.